All right, today we're up in the uh, West Fork again today. West Fork River, uh, San Gabriel Mountains. Oh, the bugs are out today. Um, this is the West Fork. And that's... Uh, today we're going to do a little different. Uh, today, I don't have my uh, hiking boots, socks, shorts. We're gonna do a little different today. Today we're going to we're gonna bike over to Cogswell Dam. Uh, take my bike on over there, uh, down the trail here. It's uh, about eight miles, seven, eight miles. I've read different on the internet. Some say seven, some say eight. Uh, it's so we'll go with eight. Eight miles down to the dam, uh, maybe a little past it. Uh, we'll stop along the way, eat breakfast. Um, it's just a mountain bike. Um, I haven't done really anything to it to change. I put some lights on it, uh, the headlight and the rear light. Um, change the seat. Uh, change the tires to these uh, specialized Hemisphere flag jackets. They're supposed to be a little tougher, some kind of synthetic rubber. I don't know. It's also good. So let's get started. Head down the trail. You'll see why they call it a slide area. We're right up against the, the mountain on this side right here. All kinds of uh, debris. I guess the rocks fall down off here. I don't know what kind of rock it is, but it's a. Uh, like layered, it doesn't look all that stable. <laughs> it's kind of cool, you're right up against the side here. That's looking up. I don't know if you can see, but the water's coming from up top. Can't tell if it's seeping out of the ground. Right here it's dripping down. Well they said about about five, six miles in and it's it's six miles, six miles just up ahead. They said uh, there'd be a waterfall to the south side of the uh, of the road but <laughs> there normally would be a waterfall I think right there. There's actually a couple. There's one just behind that one also, they say. But uh, we're in such a low water year that uh, there's no water. It's absolutely no water there right now. About six and a half miles in, come up to Glen Campground. Pretty nice. The canyon opens up in this area. They even have some restrooms. At seven miles in, they say you uh, come to this uh, area. It says private residence. But I, th I read somewhere that uh, the rangers use these, these homes while they're out here. Oh, well, they have a nice area to stay in, huh? Well, we made it. It's uh, 8.30 in the morning. The last, uh, last mile and a half is all uphill. <laughs> There's the dam. 
I'm not sure I want to go out across it. You can go across it over to the other side and up the canyon over there. But it's all in the sun and it's blazing hot already this morning. It's pretty cool. I don't know if you can tell, but it's downhill. At least it's downhill the whole way back. But man, that last mile and a half was a was a bear. Not a bear like in the woods that I saw up in uh, Crystal Lake, but whew, that was a rough one. All right, I'm gonna go across it. The sun is out and it's hot. Well, wow. really is low water. There's hardly any water down there. Cogswell Dam is supposed to be, I think, the first in a series of five dams that uh, that funnel the um, the San Gabriel River down to the ocean. This is the. Uh, the east side of the dam. It's the West Fork River down there. And our way out is way back there. Here's a look uh, of the dam area on the, uh, I guess, the northwest side of it. There's some kind of a service road down here. All right, I stopped at the um, that campground. I'm all the way back, and uh, it's kind of nice in here. They got benches, fire pit, barbecue, but I got my I got my Snow Peak. Light Max Titanium Stove with the uh, Snow Peak Giga Power Fuel and my Optimus Terra Solo boiling some water. And today's menu is Quaker Oatmeal. Stuff is good. It's a little warm. I thought it was going to be a little cooler this morning. But uh, I should enjoy it. <laughs> 